we got a pretty scary situation going on uh, happening Monday and Tuesday, which the media is completely silent about. I haven't heard uh, Dick about it at all. Any channel, any media out outlet in America haven't heard anything. It's called Operation Gotham Shield. Okay, it's supposed to start Monday and Tuesday. It's supposed to simulate a uh, nuclear strike. Uh, it's uh, happened in New York and uh, New Jersey area. Literally, no coverage. No one's talking about it. But you, you know these these exercises and drills they are they have false flag written all over them. Happens every fucking time. Happened September 11th. Happened with the Boston Mar uh, Marathon bomber. It this is <laughs> this this is how they do things. This, this is how uh, the shadow government, the globalists, the elitists, the rich, the powerful. Uh, this this is how they they hide their agenda. They have these exercises, this, these simulated drills, and uh, behind behind all this, like no one ever covers these. No one ever talks about it until after the fact. After the fact, people ask the question, "Oh, I wonder why was that going on? Like how that's really weird. Like why was that going on? Like, no one asks beforehand. They don't, you know. They they think we're blind to all this, blind to the whole situation. And I'm I'm you know I'm really terrified." Uh, about Operation Gotham Shield. I mean, it's it's really creepy. Like everyone who's in, who, who's involved. N n the the real big thing about it is like n n I haven't heard anything about this. I happened to look like, be on YouTube and looking around, and I saw one, someone made a video about this. Then I started looking it up, and I was like, "Holy shit!" If you dig a little deeper, yeah, you can see this. You know, it's <sighs> this this is insane. Between this, you know, th this is like something that's leading up to the whole North Korea, you know, business. We've seen that in the news constantly. The warmongering on CNN and Fox. Like, we're already at war or something, you know. And it's something, a false flag could definitely come from this. And they can blame it on Russia. They can blame it on North Korea. And, and you know, 95% of the population wouldn't be, the, you know, any of the wiser. Another thing I saw, like, minimal coverage on, I saw, you know, a little bit from CNN, Fox, and the major uh, news outlets, were these these power outages, and mainly I, I heard about you know I saw things reporting as San Francisco, but this this happened in multiple places in the country around the same time. And it makes you 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 know really wonder because America's electric grid, our, our infrastructure is shit. It would not take much to take it down. It's something we really need to focus on and care about. But the media they're they're too busy playing Mr. War, you know that they're p too busy ramping up the American population. To go to war with North Korea, to go to war with Russia, you know they're they're holding us by the hand, leading us into the fire, and we we need to wake up because there's a there's a lot of false flags, a lot of these situations that are getting crazier and crazier, and you, you know we just gotta open our eyes and look up, guys.